Hello guys, this is Dr. Bass. Uh, today I uh, thought you will find interesting if I will show you a little demonstration of the eddy current. So, eddy current are created when you have magnetic field crossing uh, electrically conductive parts, like uh, these copper bar here, this is a flat bar. Uh, what you see here is a uh, in-rotor rotor motor, so this is the rotor of an uh, in-rotor motor, and there's magnets on it, and uh, what you see here, this is only the um, kind of uh, stainless steel belt to uh, retain these, to avoid them to fly apart when it spin. And what I will do is, I will spin this rotor with uh, this press drill, and I will take this flat bar and show you that what it creates when I approach it, without touching it. So I have installed a black tape on this uh, piece of metal. The reason is because when you want to uh, monitor uh, infrared temp uh, temperature with infrared thermometer like this one, the infrared um, will be reflected by a polished uh, metal part like this. So it's like a mirror. So the problem is that if I point this infrared thermometer that way, it will measure the heat of the incident part right here. If I point it like that, it will measure my heat that bounds on this and that reflect into this one. Okay, so what if you want to measure the heat on this part, you have to put a black stuff that will uh, cancel reflection and only give the heat, uh, the temperature measurement of this part. Okay, so I will begin to rotate this uh, little motor. difficult. Oh, I'll get it. All right, stabilized. Great. Okay, it's stabilized now. It's running pretty, pretty fast. Okay. So now we'll show you that this part of middle is at about 25, 26 degrees. Twenty-seven maybe. Okay. And I will install it. I'll just approach this. Not too much because it will slow down the motor. Then, I will approach this piece of metal. I feel, see, it's slowing down the motor. So as the magnetic field from the magnet cross the copper part, and there is no contact, it just make it to heat, and you will see the tape just melting. It's beginning to be uh, pretty hot because it's uh, conductive. And you see the black tape here. And what's the temperature? It's about 150 degrees Celsius. See that? And it's pretty hot. I will continue, but I will use some of these and see what happens. Well, difficult. Okay, bad. Ah, it's difficult to retain, but. Little balloon on the tape. I'm getting it's pretty hot. See? Okay, this is smoke. The tape, the 
the smoking. What's the temperature? 196. So you see the copper just changed color. <laughs> so that was uh, eddy current effect. So as I explained, when the magnetic field of these magnets cross the conductive part, like copper, like this, it will induce eddy current, which will make it produce current. And there's, it's like a short circuit inside this part of metal, which produce heat because there's a high current through these conductive parts and it dissipates through heat. So I hope you enjoyed and see you next time. Bye bye.